Oh my god, I've been trying to look for a place where I can record a video for so long. Uh, I'm in Sweden right now and I have a new house here. I forgot my tripod in Spain. I'm just basically putting it on some bags and some books and whatever I found. Hi, my name is Sana. Today I was looking through the internet on YouTube, which I do quite a lot. I love watching YouTube videos and other YouTubers and see what they're up to. I came across a lot of videos which had the title, Am I Pretty? I just decided to check one out and then more and more came. I just realized there were so many videos out there of people not being confident about themselves, asking other people, random people all around the world, if they are pretty enough. I thought this was really terrible because some of the girls and some boys were as young as eight years old filming themselves asking everyone if they are pretty. I know myself that it can be really hard to be confident. Actually, I'm not really a confident person. You might have realized this if you watch Jelly's videos and if I'm in any of them. I'm kind of like a shy person. I don't really want to be on camera. That's basically because there are a lot of people who watch Jelly's videos and I'm basically afraid of what people are going to say about me. I'm just really not confident. But ever since I started YouTube, I've become more confident actually. Just because of YouTube I have met a lot of amazing people I've had amazing experiences with and they've after time helped me become more confident I've never had so many amazing people around me like I have now I have Jelly who's amazing he likes me for exactly who I am I can be myself around him it's really hard to find a person like that also I have a lot of amazing friends like Emilia Natalie and Yara and also Hannah of course and the list goes on I have a lot of amazing friends who are there to support me through whatever I'm going through. I know there are a lot of people who are not confident about themselves and they don't have a lot of people around them who can help them overcome this. There are so many people out there who try to hide themselves from who they really are. Before I met all these amazing people and before I was able to become myself, be myself, uh, I used to pretend to be someone else. Someone who is more, it's really hard to explain, but I, I just try, I just really wanted to fit in. And so I tried to be more like everyone else. But after some time, I realized that that didn't make me happy. And I wanted to be more myself because that's what makes me happy. And because of my confidence of being myself, I could find all these friends who like me for exactly who I am and not for being someone who I was not. And back to the people who made the videos with the titles, Am I pretty? I just think that people nowadays get judged for so little things. I just think that people should stop being so harsh on themselves and start being themselves. I think you should start respecting yourself and others. If there is a person you don't like, a lot of people tackle this situation the wrong way. What you really should do if you don't like someone, you should stay away from them. But a lot of people start hating on them and bullying them, which is really, really wrong. And people can be terrible. As an example of this, I know a person. I'm not going to say any names because I know a lot of people I know watch my videos. So this girl or boy has a passion for something. He or she loves doing this and, um, and showing people the goals that she or he has achieved. This was quite a long time ago, but I was in a group chat and I was texting around and uh, they started talking about this person. Uh, they started texting and they weren't really nice about it. I was a bit joining in, which I really, really regret now. Um, I know everyone has things they have done or said which they regret. And this is something I really regret. So I didn't take a big part of this, but I was just joining in. I didn't say my own opinion or anything. But in the end, I was just thinking about what this person was doing and this person was doing it because it made him or her happy and there are not a lot of people in this world who do this so i started texting back in the group chat telling all the people saying that we're just jealous that person is confident enough of showing people what he or she wants to do and is capable of doing and what he or she has achieved when we are just sitting there on our phones bitching about them which is terrible i think that's terrible just because other people are too too afraid of saying what they want to say and doing what they want to do, they just start judging other people who are trying. I'm really really happy for stepping up and uh, telling them that this is wrong. We should be doing what we want to do and we should let them do what they want to do. From now on, when I hear people bitching about other people, I just try to stay away because I'm not that person and I believe that they can do whatever they want. Unless it's like killing someone, of course. <laughs> I believe that if you have a dream and you are confident enough of showing people that you are fighting for it, then I really do have respect for you and you should just keep on going because that is going to bring you success in life. I made a video not that long ago with the title, My School Found Out. 
basically it got a lot of positivity a lot of you guys made so many amazing comments saying oh my god this was so inspirational this i'm gonna start my own youtube channel now at least this is what a lot of people commented saying to me and that i helped them be able to do what they want to do i didn't really realize that i did this in the video i was basically just talking and just trying to help you but i didn't know it was gonna have this big of an impact so i decided to just make this video again just telling you guys to continue being yourself don't listen to what other people say if they don't have anything good to say don't listen to it and just start being yourself and try to be more confident and just try to make your dreams come true and doing what you love to do because that is what's gonna make you happy and that's what you're gonna look back to when you are sitting there in your old chair and ready to die well, this sounds really terrible, but those are the things you're gonna remember, which are you gonna be happy about? And that's what's gonna make you have no regrets when you're older. Knowing that you did what you wanted to do and what you love to do, there is nothing better than that. So just keep on moving. Just block out all the haters. It doesn't matter how many you have. Just keep on doing what you want to do because good people will come and they will come and support you. Even if you don't think that things are gonna get better, they will, they will get better. Just keep on doing what you love to do and I really hope that I could help you with this video, sharing some of my own experiences with you. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you guys so much for being so supportive to me. When I was reading through the comments, I, I just like, I just felt so motivated and I just was so happy and just made me feel, you guys are just amazing and you guys are the reason to why I'm doing this, why I'm making my dreams come true. So thank you guys so, so much for everything. I guess I'll see you in the next video. I love you so much and bye. Can we wait? No, 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 okay. Are you ready? Yes. Oh!